Here is my novel study on Harry Potter. I hope you enjoy it. When you get a letter to Hogwarts, it will look like this. It will say that you have been accepted to the school. For example, this one reads, Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry, Headmaster, Alice Dumbledore, Order of Merlin, First Class, Grand Sorcerer, Chief Warlock, Supreme Mugwump, International Confederation of Wizards. Dear Mr. Potter, we are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Please find enclosed a list of all necessary books and equipment. Term begins on September 1st. We await your owl by no later than July 31st. Yours sincerely, Minerva McGonagall, Deputy Headmistress. If you're a muggle-born like me, meaning my parents have no magical abilities, special messengers will be sent to explain everything. If you're a first year, your list of items would look like this. The best place to go is to Diagon Alley to get your school supplies. The first thing I would do is exchange my muggle money for wizard money at Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Wizard money includes galleons, sickles, and canucks. Gringotts is guarded by goblins. The goblins will take you to your vault. You have to have a key to enter your vault at Gringotts. This is an example of a vault. For extra security, there is a dragon that guards important parts of Gringotts. You do not want to get caught stealing from Gringotts, or else this may happen. buy your school supplies, including one wand from Ollivander. Then, Ollivander will give you a wand to try out, because the wand chooses the wizard, not the other way around. Wands are made of things like holly, oak, like vine, hazel, elder, ash, and birch. They have different cores, like phoenix, tail feather, unicorn hair, and dragon heartstring. No two Ollivander wands are the same, just as no two unicorns, dragons, or phoenixes are quite the same. And of course, you will never get such good results with another wizard's wand. Other items I would get include a pet, which is optional, books from Flourish and Blots, Robes from Madame Malkins, a cauldron, parchment, pills, and ingredients for potions. Once I got all my stuff from Diagon Alley, I would go to King's Cross Station. When I get there, I'll run straight through the barrier between platforms 9 and 10. That should lead me to platform 9 and 3 quarters. The letter I got should have gave me a ticket for the Hogwarts Express to train. Then I would get on the train and wait till we get to the Hogwarts. I might even meet some friends on the way there. When you get to Hogwarts, if you're a first year like me, you would go to Hagrid to take a boat across the lake. Once you get there, you would go into the Great Hall and get sorted by the Sorting Hat into one of the four houses. Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin. Welcome to Hogwarts. The start of term banquet will begin shortly. But before you take your seats in the Great Hall, you will be sorted into your houses. The sorting is a very important ceremony because while you are here, your houses will be somewhat like your family within Hogwarts. You will have classes with the rest of your house, sleep in your house dormitory, and spend free time in your house common room. If you are a Gryffindor, you would go with a prefect to the fat lady, who will ask you for the password and let you in. Some experiences you may have will include the Daily Prophet, Riding a Broom slash Quidditch, Hogsmeade, and Trying Magic.
two very important rules made by the Ministry of Magic are no doing magic outside of Hogwarts until you are 17 years old and stay in bed after hours. One of my favorite classes would probably be potions because I like cooking and mixing ingredients. And that's pretty much what potions is. I hope you enjoyed my project about Harry Potter. Thank you for watching.